slow down. You're fine. Four people now dead in the wake of the shooting at Oxford High School Tuesday. The effects of such a violent act felt far beyond the small metro Detroit community. We're hearing all kinds of rumors about warning signs. I can tell you that uh, we have a, a school a liaison deputy that's assigned to the high school. Uh, I'm not aware of and we are not aware of any warnings. Parents everywhere left to help their children make sense of something potentially world shattering. The idea that they are simply not safe at school. We don't want to pretend that, that, you know, these things don't happen. We acknowledge, yes, bad things happen, but that we follow that up with reassurance. Dr. Adele Kadouj says when things like this happen, it can destroy a young person's sense of control in life. So we can acknowledge that, yes, there are some things that are outside of our control. We can't control what other people do, um, but there are things then that we can control. <laughs> to put power back into our children's hands. Okay to Say is a program launched by the Attorney General's office in 2014, meant to provide an easy and anonymous way for students to report concerns about safety in their school or for the well-being of others. Okay to Say is not about getting kids in trouble. Okay to Say is really about trying to get kids the help they need before a situation turns tragic. We're really kind of putting that reality in place so that we can regain some sense of control of the things that we actually do have control over. Since its inception, OK to Say has received over 1,100 tips about potential school attacks. Kids know what's right and what's wrong. And so if kids just have that feeling that something isn't right, Hey, you know, let us know. Submitting a tip on the OK to Say website is simple and quick, and nobody has to leave their name. I would imagine, Mary, that it's important for students to re to think about when you see something, don't assume that somebody else has reported it or that person themselves has reported it. Right, absolutely. In fact, we know that sometimes you can have a group of students who see the same thing, and because they are a group that witnesses it, they think, well, somebody else will do it. And we just say, please, just submit the tip. So, yeah, and we had just heard from Attorney General Dana Nessel, this program, OK to Say, actually introduced by her predecessor, Bill Schuette, back in 2014. She's, they are trying to push forward these resources, make them ever that much more available accessible to any student that find themselves potentially looking at something concerning. For now, live in the control room, Michael Martin, Fox 17 News. All right, thank you for that, Michael. And of course, we do plan to bring more coverage on the Oxford High School shooting. You can stay with Fox 17 for future updates, both on air, online. And you can also download our news apps to get the latest.